Hey there, Tenty here again with another video for you. This time I'm showing you a Google Maps preview. This is Google Maps as it, as it is as it stands today. As I record this video, as I've uploaded this video, you can get the new Google Maps, um, but currently as it is today, this is what it looks like. So I'm going to do a quick search for Chadston Shopping Centre in Victoria. Because, you know, that's the fashion capital in Melbourne, so hey, why not? Let's choose that. And you'll be familiar with the colours and what it looks like today. So if I click on any of these, a little, like, almost like a comic-style chat bubble comes up, and you can see the information of, uh, you know, wh where the address is, what the phone number is, etc. You've got these blue dots scattered around the place when you drag your little man over. Um, that's to show you the user submitted photos and obviously if you drag the blue over the road um, you can see where the Google streetcar has been. What else is there? Well, in fact I'm not going to show you too much about the old Google Maps because we all know what it looks like. I want to show you the new Google Maps. So I'm going to click on Maps. I'm going to click on the Get the New Google Maps. It shows me that I can click to be invited into a preview and I've already been invited and that's why congratulations I'm in and here is the new Google Maps loading up you can see that the colors have been redefined um, it looks slicker the interface just seems a lot nicer um, they've unified it with this search box up the top left hand corner and if I go and click any one of these little icons, you'll see that the text moves around dynamically. And in the top left hand corner, we have the address, the name of the store, the, their operating hours, directions, their website, their phone number, and I can obviously save it. If I want directions, I click that, I get an A to B drop down this time. And if I actually put in the right address, because I actually wanted the center of Chadston as a suburb, so let me do that now. You'll see I've got a couple of different options. I've got the normal car option, public transport option, which has been grayed out, and a walking option and a cycling path option. I can click any of these trails on the map or the cards to change between the different options that I've got. So here's the walking option. And again, I can click on the trail and find out how far I need to go. Here's the cycling option. And I can click around the different paths. And the one thing that you can't see here is an aeroplane option. So if you do need to take a jet uh, or an aeroplane to somewhere, you can actually do that. Um, there's the normal hide and show traffic, there is avoid highways, avoid tolls, you can change it from miles to kilometres, we live in Australia, we use kilometres, and that's what that looks like. We have this Earth view, which is the satellite view that exists today in the normal Google Maps, and you can see how slick it is that that transition to change between Earth view and the normal view. Um, this obviously shows the hybrid view so you can actually see the street names and everything over the top um, if you want pure satellite view you just go and use something like Google Earth but you can swap between Earth view and Maps view just by clicking the left hand corner there is this new explore option so user submitted content you can actually um, bring up this explore panel and click and that will actually take you to the user submitted photo and of course if you want to go back to the maps it's on the left hand side always on the left hand side never changes really nice and slick interface what else have we got so we've got the normal traffic icon that you can see uh, if you're not within the the directions view uh, we also have street view so you click on the road that you want the box comes up you click Street View. There's no more dragging this little man over the thing. You just click and you click and then that's it. It's really, really nice and simple. So that's really it as a preview into Google Maps. I hope you've enjoyed this and 
don't forget to comment and subscribe to my content to see more. Thanks for watching, this is Tenti, out.